Now, I am bringing to you the latest from uh, the Democratic Republic of Congo. And uh, I should say that uh, this is not good news on uh, the side of UPDF. Yes, this is not good news on uh, the side of UPDF. You really want to know what is happening in the Democratic Republic of Congo, DRC, on the side of UPDF right there. We have our sons right there. We have our sisters right there. We have our generals right there. So you really want to know what is happening in the DRC. My name is Fula very good morning thank you so much for subscribing to the buzz ug in case you haven't kindly tap on that subscribe word on your screen and uh, don't forget to tap on the bell as well for all the notifications now the spokesperson of uh, the updf has actually come out to reveal that uh, in the democratic republic of congo there is a armed group that is planning to use updf uniforms to destabilize the civilians and actually committing all sorts of uh, atrocities against the civilians so that it is taken as if it's the UPDF causing havoc and actually stealing from the public in the Democratic Republic of Congo. Now, Brigadier General Flavia Biekwaso, UPDF spokesperson, says that uh, recently inside Congo, they impounded a truck that was carrying UPDF uniforms and uh, the person who was transporting these uniforms is a businessman. And uh, guess what? This guy was actually coming from Uganda. So Flavia says that... Uh, you know, this guy was actually arrested and uh, whatever in that truck was inbounded. And uh, as we speak right now, uh, he's being interrogated in the UPDF camps that is in the Democratic Republic of Congo. But uh, Flavia says that... Uh, they have enough information. This is a armed group in Congo aiming at uh, dattening the UPDF name in the DRC. Yes, so they have that information. Uh, you can wake up one morning and you hear UPDF is killing people, UPDF is stealing from the public, UPDF is stealing gold from uh, Congo. But uh, Flavia Biekwaso says that uh, this is a group that is aiming at using uh, UPDF uniform so that they can actually datten the UPDF name in the Democratic Republic of Congo and on the international level you get yes and actually in her official statement through her social media platforms Flavia asked the public to be aware of this news. Just be aware of this news. You can wake up one morning and you hear that UPDF is doing all, all sorts of dirty things in uh, the Democratic Republic of Congo. But Flavia says that please make sure that you don't take this information serious. They are already working on these people and uh, they hope that they will get them as soon as possible. But of course the Operation Shuja is still going on in the DRC. As we speak right now, UPDF has killed or has put out of action and number of uh, ADF rebels and uh, others have actually surrendered and others have been apprehended. Yes, so uh, the operation is still going on and of course right here on uh, the Buzz UG, we wish them all the best. We hope that uh, they succeed on this one. They are on. Yes, so that is the latest from uh, the UPDF camp and uh, in case anything else comes up, definitely we shall keep you posted. What you have to do is just one thing, subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't and tap on the bell as well for all the notifications. My name is Fula. Thank you.